Well, looks like I'm out of air. Small, tiny hole in the tire. Overall, this ride has been fantastic. I've been testing out the new GX Axis drivetrain and it's been fantastic. This stuff is super responsive. Honestly, you shift gears probably twice as much as you did before. Gotta do a slow roll here. But yeah, today's video is gonna be about the GX Axis. We're about 10K into the ride and it's all gone to hell. Flat tire, no sealant left. And the hole was so small, I didn't wanna put a big fix in it because it just seemed like it would do more damage to the tire than help. We just gotta do a slow roll back. And while we're doing that, I may as well talk about the GX Axis. So this is the entry level in the electronic wireless shifting set. Oh, bit narrow. It's been great. I know some people are not huge fans Ooh. of the rocker shifter. I personally do not mind it. I'm in shambles, I got a hole in my glove now too. Yeah, I do not mind the rocker shifter. I think it's working really well. It's getting a little getting used to, but otherwise it's shifting great. It's so quick. Like you push a button and it's already shifted before you're even done like thinking about shifting. So I'm shifting twice as much as I normally would, getting way more efficient and holding a really good cadence and average pace in this ride. It fits in the thumb really well, feels comfortable to just rest there. I think we'll focus on riding here for a second. Hold on. Price-wise, it's expensive. Price-wise, it's not too expensive. So it's hard to say if it's worth it. It's insanely good. It works well. So it's very good value for an electronic shifting set. It works fantastically. I've seen rumors and heard things that the clutch system isn't as strong as the non-electric counterparts or the higher end electric counterparts. We made it to a trail map. This is, this is where we are. And all the way up there is the parking lot. So we can go this way or straight. So we're gonna take the easy route out. We're gonna take the easy way out and we can maybe finish this review. But I haven't heard complaints. Ride with a guy who has it and he doesn't really have complaints. He noticed it sounding a little louder on the rougher descents, but not enough to complain about. The actuation, the shifting is clicking a mouse and it shifts. It's that fast, it's that efficient, it works well. Battery life has been pretty good. Um, you'd have to keep on top of it and it is another battery to charge. But if you buy a second battery, you'll always have a backup and that's probably the wisest bet. Otherwise, I think it's a fantastic shifting set. Well worth the price if you're looking at an electric setup. I don't know at what point you should put it on, at what level of bike. If you have a $2,000 Roscoe, like this would be a really nice setup for it. Is it crazy to spend half in the just derailleur system? Maybe. I've got my standard Shimano XT cassette and chain on here. So all it was was the derailleur and the shifting unit and a clamp for the um, handlebar because it took a different one. But otherwise, uh, it will work no problem. It was a quick one. It's getting dark. I'm walking through the woods. I feel like I saw bear poo, so we're just gonna end it here and uh, continue our walk back. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope this helped. It's worth it. It's fantastic. It's everything you dreamed of. Yeah. Thanks.